Ha ha, what's going on everybody? You know it's time. You know what time it is. It's Tuesday. It's time for Stevens A-List, okay? I'm supposed to be doing this from Houston, Texas, but I don't usually have on my fly gear. I'm in travel mode and stuff like that. I only brought one outfit, okay? I'm not in studio with the big board and all of that other stuff. So I decided to alter the proceedings for this particular Tuesday. What I'm going to do is I'm going to hand the baton to Sergeant Friday himself, the one and only Jeff Saturday. Remember, there is a standard to uphold here, okay? And unlike me, Jeff, oh you're not yeah, to Jeff, say. get him. So yeah, 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 yes. yeah. We got an A-list that is better than ever. In 2024, Stephen likes to put his list up. I'm gonna give the real list today so y'all see what it's all about. And listen, I'm trying to stir it up, America. Last time I was here before Christmas, I got 57%. I want 60 plus percent for this week from this list. Stephen A's never been in that realm. We're about to see it today. At number five, bam! Dallas Cowboys. That it listen, this football team with Dak Prescott. Second in the NFC right now. I love their style. Dak Prescott, the way he's playing defense. Get at it. The only negative for me, the only negative why they're five right now is the run game. Little bit concerned right there. Can they really play ground and pound? Can they close games out? But listen, beating the Dolphins, big time, big time play for this team. I like, I'm sorry, the Cowboys finishing the season the way they did. Big time for me there at number five. Going number four. Boom! Buffalo Bills. How about them Bills? They just beat the Dolphins. Listen, this was a big time game to show up and, by the way, turn the ball over the way they did and still finish the mission the way they did. Incredible close. You, you got one of the best QBs in the world making these type of plays. Defense has gotten better after they lost all the injuries they had. This team has fought back. James Cook has been housing it. Big time change on that offense. I like where they are. They're number four team. Who's my number three team? Bam! Cleveland Browns. There's a surprise for everybody. Putting Cleveland Browns at number three. Joe Flacco has turned this football team offensively on its head. He is averaging over 300 yards throwing the ball. We always think about the Browns being ground and pound. Great defense. All this kind of stuff. They don't need to play ground and pound. They got a great defense, and Flacco is airing out. Amari Cooper's making plays. This team is hot, and Joku's making plays. I love this. And guess what? They may have beaten the teams that are above them. We ain't got there yet, but this team has played really good football. I'm excited to see what they do in the playoffs. At number two, bam, San Francisco 49ers. Now, listen, I teetered to really see how much attention y'all paid. I teetered on the 49ers being one for me. I didn't. I held back because of what Purdy did when they played the Ravens. Still got to get over that. But I love this 49ers football team. And I think if they have the matchup, they will. I may even favor. But I got them second right now because of the number one team. And we saw what they did to them. National television, the way they played. Bam! My man, Baltimore Ravens. Hey, listen, this team has played. They have finished strong. You saw John Harbaugh celebrating last night with his brother Jim Harbaugh. Championship. He wants to get his second championship this week. I mean, this year, this is a huge, huge opportunity. I think it's the best Ravens team they've had in a few years where Lamar Jackson is playing at MVP level. But the defense, y'all. And listen, they have cycled through running backs, and they continue to make plays. Offensive line has played well. That Ravens is a number one team. They proved it to America. That guy's proved it through the playoffs. That's what we're looking for. First, you, Shay Shay, tell me. Come on, Shay Shay. What do you think? I, I was go. I was go let. St I was go let Stephen A. go. Let him go ahead and uh, uh, retort that list. I don't know, Stephen A. I, I'm not feeling this list as what? much as I thought I would because last week, Friday, uh, I mean Saturday night, we were on the same page. Yeah. But right now, I'm looking at this list right now. I gave it a strong B plus. In the five spot, I got the Lions. The most wins they've had in a very, very long time. Twelve and five, won the division. The Cowboys, the way they played the last month of the season to overtake the uh, the Eagles and win that division, I got them at four. The Buffalo Bills went on the road, beat the Miami Dolphins, and won that division despite Josh Allen's two terrible interceptions in the end zone and a costly fumble. I do got that. I kept the 49ers in the two spot. Even though they lost, they sought a lot of their starters. And number yeah. one, there was no debate about that. Hey, Number one is easy. That's number one on everybody's list. I got the Ravens. Right, can, so can I, I got say the Lions at five, yeah, yeah. the Cowboys right. yes. at four, the Bills at three, the Niners at two, and the Ravens at one. All right, let me say this about the Lions. The only reason I put 
The, I didn't put the Lions in. I think I'm going to have to favor the Rams this weekend over the Lions because I – and so, to me, I didn't want to be – I didn't want to be a hypocrite. I know it's fluid, but I'm just thinking <laughs> in my head a little advanced. I was like, man, the Rams wow. going to their play because the Rams are the hot Matthew, right now. The They're Matthew playing, Stafford Bowl. Going you're, back you're to you're Detroit. Go, okay? That's the only re- – listen, because I love what Dan Campbell's done. That was my only hiccup of not putting them on. But I do respect it, but that was the reason I didn't do that. Okay. Uh, What's the guy for you today? I, I, well, first of Wait, all, I didn't get the grade. First of all, I ain't giving them. He gave me a B plus. Oh, B plus? I didn't hear you. Sorry. Yeah, I gave B plus. Okay. Yeah. Go, I ain't giving them no. I ain't giving them no damn B plus. First of <laughs> all, you. Uh, last time I checked, weeks ago. Jeff Saturday got on me because he said, you ain't getting any points for doing a predictable with the one and two slots. Anybody could do that. So you ain't getting that, right? Now we got to go to spot three, four, and five. And I'm sitting there going like this. The Browns are a wild card team. How am I going to put them ahead of the Cowboys or the Lions, who are both division winners? I'm not doing that. I can respect where you're coming from in terms of what you see from Joe Flacco. But even even Jeff Saturday reminded us that Joe Flacco, as great as he has been, averaging 323 passing yards, he's also been throwing some interceptions as well, and that's not yes. going to win for you come playoff time. Those are your words, Jeff Saturday, not mine. I'm using your words against you. So in other <laughs> words, I'm not going to be, I'm not going to be, I'm not going to be as incendiary as you. I'm not going to call your list trash like you would say about me, wow. but what I would say is that I'm very disappointed. I'm very disappointed. Your words, you said one and two was predictable. You also sat up there and said, yo, not only is it unpredictable, is it predictable rather but you also pointed out division winners compared to wild card teams as well. And then you brought up the Rams into the equation as well, which would be a legitimate reason why the Browns should be out of the top five. Oh. I'm sorry. Get that list away from me. I'm rolling with Shay Shay, oh, and I'm listen. not giving you a B plus. I- I'm giving you a B. I laid the trap for you, Stephen A., and you fell right into it. Right into the trap. What's the trap? Who is the only team? Who's the team that beat this team and that team? The Browns. Is it Brown. that team? Yeah. How are you going to take that team no, out no, no, no. when they beat the yeah. dogs and they I beat the dogs? I just told you how. No, that's the yeah. trap. I just you fell into it. No, no, no. It ain't about, it ain't about division. It ain't about division. Molly, it's about like where respond. they match it up. That's where we no. are. No. You, no. Yes. you, you may respond, said, but keep You quick. said that. You said that. I didn't, I didn't have a problem with it until you pointed out weeks ago that that didn't count. It was fluid. It's fluid. It's fluid. So guess what? It's I fluid changed in my it. Direction. It's fluid. Get that my list, list out of here. I changed Get it. Get that list it's out fluid. of here. And the trap so, was Lions, set. You, two you teams, fell in. The Lions and the Rams who could have been on the list. That's what you do. heard him. You well, fell in. Say, you fell in the trap. Fell all right. in. Can we? All right. So we have we have a B. And Come on, America. Go. Let's go, America. Oh, yes! we got an A. Yes. Oh, you got an A. Yes. Oh, please. Yes. Oh, please. Yes. Oh, How about yes. that? Yes. Two tests, two A's, no. baby. But yes. Right. Saturday. 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 You got to understand, though. First but take, Sam. Come points. through on the clutch. You're, no, you're 14 points lower than what you were last week. You were going for 60. You at 43. It's fluid. It's fluid. It'll get better. It'll get better. It's still an A. We're still we're great on the curve. We still got the A, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Look how look how disappointed look at this, Stephen, look at Stephen A. a. Look Broken. At the Broken. His soul is yeah, crushed. It should be. It so, should be. Stephen A. Just think, think about what you just did and yeah. what just happened. Think okay? about it. Just think about on it. On the whole flight home, think about yeah, it, Stephen A. Just think about all of it. Everything. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not going home. I'm, I'm going oh. home. <laughs>